check out this Roadshow Rewind. This morning in Michaela to mommy, if you have children, you probably have fond memories of the day they were born. But do you recall how that first night was? How it felt going home with a newborn or wish you had certain advice for the moment you welcomed your child into the world? We had the chance to meet two new moms who opened up about those first moments, days and weeks of being a parent. The doctor had said you go to the hospital when the contractions are five minutes apart and they're really painful and for me it didn't really feel like pain, it was just the super intense pressure. I remember reading that, you know, just your body will work better if you just stay calm, you know, so that was my, my thing, I tried to remain sort of zen. Even delivering two weeks late and with an unexpected C-section. He's brought such joy to our lives, like just watching him grow and experiencing childhood through his eyes again, you know, like every tiny step, it's a miracle. That first night was a lot. I remember me and my husband just looking at each other and being like, oh my God, what did we do? But it was very exciting at the same time. I just tried to take advantage of as many helpers as I could in the hospital and getting as much advice as possible. Mm -hmm. I think I rang my, you know, bell 20 times a day, you know, and just be like, is this right? Am I doing this right? It was awful and we were so happy to have the people to help because he he wouldn't stop crying that night. We couldn't soothe him for anything. We got home and um, didn't sleep for several weeks. There's a baby in there, yeah. You're smart. Their advice for moms to be? For real, pack the bag. It was packed by the time we were ready to go, but like just barely. I think I packed it that afternoon and that just was lucky. Um, so have it, but really don't overpack it. I know this is silly to focus on the bag, but I didn't use most of what was in it. <laughs> I would say just go in open-minded. You know, you can have your goals, but you know, who knows what's gonna happen. And any way they get here is great. And go with the flow. You're not in control anymore. <laughs> it's like the baby's in control. You just have to go with their schedule and realize that not everything's gonna get done. You know, maybe I can't do the dishes right now or do the cleaning and that's okay. They say a lot about creating a birth plan. So you want to have this kind of music and you want to have these things with you and you want to have a natural birth or you want to have an epidural or you want to have whatever it is that you want to have. And, and thankfully when they're telling you about the birth plan, they're also saying and be ready to throw it out the window. Once home. It felt like the longest month in the middle of it, but it was gone before I knew it. That month was rough, but it goes away. It gets much better. It is a lot, and sometimes it can be lonely, especially in those first couple weeks when you're up at night and you start, like, the weight of all the decisions weighs on you, you know? And that's why I think it's important to, like, have family around and have people to talk to. Like at the nursing group where Molly and Susanna met. So I usually like to give some good demonstrations so people can really relate what's happening in the womb. We're engaging them to kind of play around with the balloon and see how, you know, the uterus changes when it's contracting. All fours is a very great position. Your left side is something that the doc doctors are always telling mothers to do. Okay. Um, but I also like to connect the fathers with the experience of gaining 25 pounds might be. You have no <laughs> idea what we go through. <laughs> but you're in it together and it's best to live in the moment. He changes so quickly that I want to enjoy the things he's doing right now. Yeah. And I don't want to miss them because he's not going to do them forever. I like to think that like in those moments where you're holding them and you're like, oh, I have a million other things to do that you should just look at them and, and hold them and appreciate this like moment because it, it will go by so fast. They were so cute. How are you feeling? I think the baby's kicking. Yeah. <laughs> no, but really, are you feeling it already? I can feel it. Feel I can feel it more so on my shoulders. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you no, still got, I, yeah. You still got what? You have 40 minutes. Cover up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you have any advice for new moms or new parents, right. well, I'm sure you remember those first couple I days do. coming home with the girls. Another one on the way. Uh, you can share your memories and share them with us on our social media pages. And for a link to South County Health, you can go to our website. Be sure to catch the Road Show weekday mornings at 9 on WPRI 12.